Hey guys, it's Shannon. And Paul. And today we're here with some fun Disney Haunted Mansion pins. Ooh, awesome. So I like these. It says Haunted Mansion Authentic. I like the little... Um, authentic. Yeah. <laughs> I like the little like cameo or badge there. It's pretty Ooh, cool. Yeah. So here are the pins in this collection. There are only six to collect. And they look pretty awesome. So we have the clock, unfortunately, is a chase pin. That glows in the dark. I really hope we get that because, well, I want all six of them. But we have ten packs, so ten chances to get the full set. Paul's going to go first. All right. Uh, I'm going to take my patented top row second one in. So it's the four stretching portraits, the haunted mansion plaque, and the clock. I want the uh, stretching portrait of the ballerina over the alligator. Okay. That's my favorite one. Maybe she's a tightrope walker. I think that's... she's a tightrope walker. Yeah. That's what that sounds. Here we go. Okay, looks like I'm going to have the plaque. I do. Nice. I have the Haunted Mansion plaque. Very cool. I know that if, if you went to the not so scary Halloween party, you could take a picture next to the plaque holding a lantern. Or maybe they didn't let you hold the lantern, maybe they added that in. I don't remember. I forget. I'll have to but. see if I can find a picture of you doing it. Yep. And I could insert the picture right here for everybody to see. <laughs> there we go. Hunt do you want me to do that? Sure, if you can find the picture easily. <laughs> I don't know if I can find the picture easily. Okay, there's some packs for you. Here's my first pack. I don't care which one I get because I want to see all of them. I love the Haunted Mansion. It's my favorite. Oh, come out. Ooh, a different pin. We have the stretching portrait of the uh, lady on, is it her husband's? Yes. Tombstone? Yeah. I don't, are we sure? Is that what it is? I'm pretty sure. Okay. So there she is. So the stretching portrait, it's a little bit smaller than I thought it would be. Um, it's still really cool. And actually, I'm not wearing my reading glasses, but I can still see the picture on here really well. So it's done well. I like that. So the old lady on the tombstone. Maybe it's her tombstone. I don't know. It's not her tombstone. It, okay. It's her husband's because there's an axe buried in his head. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> okay. I've never paid that much attention. I just like the portraits. Yep. But I've never paid attention. Oh, no. I have a duplicate of uh, the plaque. Oh. That's right. okay. I love that one, though. No, you go. I want you to get a new one. Key. Okay. Oh, I have a I have a portrait one. I think. Come okay. on, new one. Come on, new one. Come on, new one. Woo! Yes. Oh, it's the one I wanted. Oh, cool. Okay, it is the tightrope walker, and she is suspended over a pond with an alligator or a crocodile there coming out of the water, mouth open, just ready for her to to stumble. <laughs> but she looks balanced very very well on that tightrope. She looks very serene, very yeah, calm. She's not concerned at all. Yep, it's the little parasol she's holding. That must be it. It helps. So that is a really cute one. I like that one. I would not be calm above that alligator. Just because you don't have a parasol. That must be it. You heard it here, folks. That's the key. It is. Uh-oh. We have a Haunted Mansion plaque. Wow, lots of those. Go yep. again. Okay. Then we'll go one and one. We have, okay, we have another portrait. Is it a new one? It is a new one! Okay, so this is the two, no, the guy over quicksand? Is no. It, there's another guy, no, he's on a barrel. Yeah, he's standing on the barrel of dynamite. There's nobody else down there, is there? No. I can't see. No, Where are my glasses? My glasses are gone. Anyway, he might be on the floor. so he's on a barrel of dynamite. That's a really dangerous place to be. Sure is. Okay, so we just need the clock, which is the chase pin, and then the three guys in the quicksand. Now, all the haunted, all the portraits have a backstory to them. Yes. I don't happen to know it. But. Another, wow. another plaque. Four plaques. Do you want to go again? Nope, you go. So what do we need? 
the clock, the chase pin uh, clock, and, and then the other stretching portrait of the three guys. The three guys. Yeah. Okay, we have a portrait. Might it be the one we need? Come on, three guys. No, it's a duplicate of the one that I just got. Yep. Two packs left only, and we need two pins, Paul. Oh, no. This is not going so well. It's not. <sighs> Seriously? I oh, my goodness. I thought that's what I felt. I thought it was another plaque. So. Wow. That's another so we plaque. ordered these online. That's We didn't get a very good mix. That's already five of that. Yeah. And maybe six. I hopefully would not. I totally understand... I pretty much figured that we ended up getting stuff out of two different cases or boxes. Um, and if the clock pin is a chase, then I, I sort of know what the distribution is, which I can tell you. Go ahead. Yay. Yeah. We the have portrait. a portrait. All right, come on. Other one. Is come it the portrait on. we need? It's not. It's that dude again. Oh, guy again. Okay, so we have four out of the six. All right, so... Uh, what I believe, so lounge fly pins typically come in cases of 12. Yes. So usually if it's a collection of six, that would be two of each pin. If there's a chase pin, then you're going to get one chase pin and three of one pin. I strongly suspect that the Haunted Mansion plaque is the three of. You get two of each portrait, three three plaques, one clock. Well, nobody else is getting the Haunted Mansion pin yeah. that ordered around the same time as us be because we have them all. We ended up getting five, yeah, so that would be three out of one box, two out of another. Yeah. Yep, so we missed out on that stretching portrait and the clock cheese. Okay. Well, that's okay. We can still pick a favorite from these. Okay. I'm going to go with the Haunted Mansion plaque. I really like the plaque. Okay, for me it's pretty easy. I'm going with this stretching portrait. I love the stretching portrait room. It's one of my favorite attractions at Walt Disney World and uh, Disneyland. And that one is my favorite, so. Cool. There we go, that's my favorite. Uh, that's our favorites. How about you guys, which one of these did you like the best? Leave a comment down below, let us know. Leave the video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Hit the share button, make sure to subscribe. If you haven't already, it's gonna make you part of the PS Toy Reviews crew, where if you look around, you'll notice that there is no back button. You're trapped in this video. Ooh, oh Thanks no. Thanks so much for watching, we'll see you guys next time. Bye guys.